Here's the deal. The spotlight search on your Mac is badass, and you are probably not using it enough. So here's 12 different ways you can utilize Spotlight on your Mac. Here's what most people do. They use Spotlight to launch applications and open files, and that's it. But it does a lot more than that. You can use it as a calculator and do math directly in the search bar, or hit enter and open up the calculator. You can use it for unit conversions. Type in any unit, and you'll get all the important conversions, whether it's distances, volume, currency, or temperature. You can use it to look up words. Type in any word followed by definition, and you'll get a definition for your word. If you're lazy, skip the word definition, and it still works. Pro tip, hold down the option key and use the arrow keys on your keyboard to jump through the results quicker. You can use it to check the weather or to look up sports scores. You can use it to get directions, although for this one you'll have to launch the Maps app to see your directions, but Spotlight still gives you a nice shortcut. You can use it to check the stock market. Type in a ticker symbol or the company name followed by stock. You can use it to filter results if you're looking for something specific. For example, narrow down your search to a specific file type like this. You can use it to quickly jump to a specific part of your system settings. And how about this one? You can use it to track flights. Just type in the flight number, hit enter, and you'll get a nice flight tracking window directly in Spotlight. And lastly, world clock. Type in the city and you'll get the local time. Although oddly this worked when making the tutorial, but as I'm editing this, it's not currently working. But I'll include it here anyway. Might be just down temporarily right now, who knows? Anyways, there's 12 ways to use Spotlight. Let me know which ones I forgot about and smash that subscribe button on your way out so I can see you in the next tutorial.